Okay, so here's how I set up this um, page here. So I start with its, the fact that it's a Google um, slide. The nice thing about Google slide is I can hit Command Shift 4 and I can actually, when I'm done, take a screenshot of it and then it's an image. I can also go to File and export it as an image. So I'd come here to download and I'd go to export as like a JPEG for instance. And now it's an image. <laughs> A lot faster to do the screenshot I find. So this is set up in a table. So I would just went to format, or excuse me, insert, and then table, and then I choose the size table I wanted. Um, the next thing I did was I created that shape that's a button. So I come here to the shapes, or you can go to insert shape if you don't see it on your toolbar there. And then I did an arrow shape, I liked it. Um, I think I did that one. And then you just like click and drag and make it that way. You can change the background color. Um, so here's my fill color. I chose that gray just to kind of make it that way. You could do orange if you chose to. And then you insert a text box over top of it. So I just went like this. And then what did I say? Um, mute, I think I said something about mute yourself. Okay, so then I wanted to uh, highlight it to make it so I can change the font size, get it so it's kind of big. Um, you can also change so that it's aligned and it's center if you want, that kind of thing. And then the cool thing that I did is that Bitmoji part that you might have been talking about, and that you can do by downloading the Bitmoji Chrome extension. So I will share that too in the email as I respond to you. Um, so I'm going to come up here, I'm going to grab my Bitmoji one. Here it is. Cool thing about Bitmoji that you might not have known, if you use it in Google Chrome, I could type anything. And now I've got my own personalized Bitmoji. You just have to watch out for ones that are kind of inappropriate. But um, so I can kind of personalize it however I want. But this one, I wanted to be that microphone. So I just typed in mic and then I did that. And it says right click to copy, so I'm gonna right click, copy image, and then I'm gonna come in here and do my paste, which I just use Command V, and then you just have to resize it, bring it down there, and then I can actually put this in my Google, or in my classroom, or my Canvas classroom, my course, I can um, put it in as an image, um, or I can start it by going over at the beginning of every virtual meeting, just as a kind of reminder.